The programming and connections both are same as per my previous project on related subject. For getting more details about connections and programming, I suggest you to watch my previous video how to make Arduino JRBL CNC. The video link is given in description. Since operating this machine without USB cable, I using this Bluetooth module SC05 to connect this machine with PC. So we have to do some extra connections rather than connecting stepper motors and servo motors. Connect this Bluetooth module with Arduino as shown in this diagram and you also need to change some parameters of it. I made a separate video on wireless Arduino programming, watch that video to know which parameters of SC05 you should have to change. The video link is given in description. For calibrating this machine, make a simple G-code first. Open Inkscape software, go to the file, select document properties and set all dimensions you need in inches. Then set a width and height. Width is equal to 9 inches and height is equal to 7 inches. And close the window. This rectangular box is our workplace. Let's draw a square of 2 by 2 inches. Set dimensions here, width is 2 inch and height is 2 inch. Now place this square at suitable position inside of the workplace. Go to the path tab and select option object to path. Again go to the path and select dynamic offset. Now go to the extension tab, click on MIGR build Z axis servo and select it. New window will open. See these all parameters and change them if not same. Use file name here and click apply. Wait for saving. Now close it. Now open the GRBL controller and select COM port on which your Bluetooth module is connected. Here it's COM35, so selecting it. Now set baud rate is equal to 115200 from here. And click open. After successfully connected with machine, this button will turn into orange color. Now choose file which we recently created and click begin. Machine start moving. You can see the drawing progress on the screen. Let's examine the dimensions of square. It is about 1.25 inches. But the actual size of square is 2 inches. Here output size is less than actual size. So to increase the output drawing size, we need to increase revolutions for mm. For that, type $100 is equal to 750. Here in this command, $100 is for x axis and 750 are the steps. Now hit enter. And do same for the y axis. Type $101 is equal to 750 and hit enter. Now test it again. Measuring the dimensions, it is about 1.5 inches. We still need to increase steps, so repeat the previous process again. Type $100 is equal to 850 and $101 is equal to 850 and click begin. Okay, this looks good. Close enough to 2 inches. So I stopped here and draw another drawing. Let's select another G code and click begin. For source code and software, check out the link given in description. Thanks for watching the video. If you like it, give the thumbs up, comment down your doubts, and for more updates, stay connected.